Hey guys, it's Chris. From a long lost air raid shelter to the spooky remains of an unsolved mystery, here are 10 strange things found under the driveway. Number 10. Air Raid Shelter In a small English town, a hole in a man's driveway revealed an air raid shelter from World War II. It was a seriously incredible find. It all happened when a giant hole randomly appeared in his driveway one day. He first thought it was a sinkhole, but upon closer inspection, he discovered a ladder leading down to a massive underground air raid shelter from back during the war. After a bit of research, the man discovered that there had actually been quite a few air raid shelters in the area around 70 years ago, and the one buried under his driveway was in almost perfect condition. According to an article from The Sun, the house was originally purchased from an elderly couple who built it in the 70s, and the current owner figures they must have known it was there when they built the house on top of it. But nobody ever told him about the mysterious shelter just sitting there underneath of his driveway. Inside the shelter, he found relics from the war still preserved, including newspapers, old bottles, and the original building supplies. It makes you wonder just how many other British homes have a secret shelter just waiting to be discovered underneath the bones of their houses. Number 9. Ancient Skeleton It seems that England is kind of the place to be for mysterious driveway discoveries. This creepy find was made while a builder was digging up the front garden of a home in the small city of Croydon. During the excavation, he discovered a skeleton underneath the driveway that dates back to 1,300 years ago. The skeleton was an adult, and it was almost perfectly complete. After the discovery, the police came, and they sealed off the house and the area. They treated it like a crime scene, as they were unsure whether to open a murder inquiry or not. But of course, after the bones were sent to a laboratory for carbon dating, and the results showed that they dated back to somewhere around 670 AD, it was pretty obvious that no murder had taken place, at least not in the last thousand years. According to experts, the person would have died around the age of 36, but there was not much more information than that. Researchers could not discover its gender or anything about its life. The skeleton is now on display at the Croydon Museum in South London. How exactly the skeleton came to be underneath the driveway is still a mystery. Number 8. Unexploded Bomb Workers in the town of Malton, also in the United Kingdom, discovered what appears to be a pair of unexploded bombs while in the middle of laying a new driveway. They had been digging up the old road surface when they found the bombs, and as you can probably imagine, there was quite a bit of panic over it. Bomb disposal experts had to be summoned to the little town to investigate the bombs. The driveway in question belonged to a veterinary practice, and it's safe to say nobody had expected bombs to show up during the road work. They appeared to be mortar bombs, each one about the size of a wine bottle. One was clearly empty, but the other was too difficult to tell. The workers didn't want to get too close to the bombs, just in case, so they let the bomb disposal team take care of it. Even though there was very little risk of anything bad happening, the staff of the veterinary practice were sent home, and all the workmen at the adjacent property were also evacuated. At the end, the bomb squad sorted it all out and nobody was injured. Still, let's be honest, bombs aren't exactly something you want to find sitting underneath your driveway just waiting to blow your car sideways. So what would you do if you found a bomb under your driveway? I'd call the police immediately, but maybe some of you would want to play a prank and scare your neighbors by putting it out onto the street first. Let me know what you do in the comments below. And after that, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. There are lots more cool videos like this one coming out all the time, so check them out and subscribe. Number 7. A Mountain of Junk Here's a bizarre story, and it comes straight out of Ottawa, Canada. It all happened when Kit Pullen woke up on a Wednesday morning and found a massive pile of furniture stacked up on his driveway. And it wasn't just a bit of furniture, mind you, it was a significant amount. The Ottawa man claims that he had no idea how it got there, who it belonged to, or what he was going to do with it. As you can clearly see from the photos, it's a ridiculous pile of junk. It's like somebody cleaned out their entire house, drove to some random driveway, and then unloaded all of their stuff. According to one of Pullen's neighbors, there was a U-Haul van in the driveway at 3 a.m., completely unloading all the junk and piling it up front of Pullen's garage door. Pullen said it's a good thing he was retired at the time, since he couldn't even get his own car out of his own garage or deal with the aftermath of a snowstorm because there was just so much garbage piled in his driveway. 
So this one isn't really an archaeological discovery, but it's definitely a rather unpleasant discovery that nobody wants to wake up to. Considering the items were dropped off at 3 in the morning, it's doubtful they were trying to do pull in any favors. Nothing good ever happens at 3 a.m. Number 6. Alligator in the Driveway It's one thing to find a giant pile of junk stacked up in your driveway, but what do you do when you wake up and there's a giant alligator sitting on your driveway like he just owns the place? This is exactly what happened to a couple in San Antonio in the summer of 2020. They woke up, looked out their window, and were absolutely shocked to see a monster gator just lounging around, like he wasn't a big ferocious beast sitting in somebody's driveway. According to Jonathan Warner of the Texas Park and Wildlife Alligator Program, this suspicious gator was about 10 feet long and could have come from really anywhere. Warner said it was probably looking for a mate. It was definitely an older male, and judging by its size, it could be pretty old. It's not that typical in San Antonio to have gators show up on your doorstep, but it also isn't really that uncommon. Warner claimed that the gator was probably first sighted in a small pond behind a church in the area, and since then it had gradually been making its way back to its home in a nearby lake, stopping out in driveways to just take breaks, I guess. Even if this gator is peaceful enough on its own, I still wouldn't want to see him sitting on my driveway first thing in the morning. The good news here is that alligators are actually pretty skittish and not that interested in us humans. But that doesn't mean they won't bite you if you bother them, so stay clear. Number 5. Rare Stone Our second story from Canada comes to us from Saskatchewan, which is almost like the Kansas of Canada. A woman found an extremely rare rock known as a buffalo calling stone or an iniskim. It was sitting in her driveway not far from her front door. This happened at her farm, which is located close to the backwoods town of Radville. At first, it just looked like a stone, but after further investigation, the woman realized it was actually pretty significant. She had found the stone several years ago, but it wasn't until her brother-in-law, who happened to be an archaeologist, told her what the stone truly was. The founder of the stone believed it probably came from a load of gravel that was delivered to her farm and then got caught up in the dust of her driveway. She just so happened to see it standing out amongst all the other smaller stones. She contacted the local museum and after some discussions, decided to donate the stone to them. So if you're confused about what the stone is exactly, an aniskim is an extremely special object in the indigenous Blackfoot culture typically used in ceremonies. They were included in medicine bundles, often wrapped in buffalo fur, and were sometimes hung outside of lodges to call in buffalo. These stones were obviously used hundreds of years ago, and until now there have only been four of them discovered in all of Saskatchewan. It's a pretty rare thing to find buried in the dust of your own driveway. Number 4. Mystery Animal as reported by Daily Mail, an Australian man was shocked beyond belief when he looked at the CCTV footage outside of his house to see a mysterious, almost demonic animal striding across his driveway at 2 o'clock in the morning. The video shows a creature with four legs, a ridiculously long tail, and a head that could be very similar to that of a dog. After posting the still images online asking the internet community what they thought the animal was, most people believed it to be the legendary chupacabra. Of course, it's a legendary beast from Latin America, which isn't really anywhere close to Australia. Others claimed the animal was probably a Tasmanian tiger, an animal that has been extinct for more than 80 years. If you look hard at the animal in the footage and pictures of a Tasmanian tiger, they are basically identical. To give you a bit more background, the Tasmanian tiger was the largest carnivorous marsupial of our modern Earth, but it went extinct almost 100 years ago. So could this extinct animal still be roaming around? And is the only proof of its existence one blurry video in front of a guy's driveway? This discovery really has scientists scratching their heads. Australia is a big place, and there is still a slim chance that a few Tasmanian tigers live deep in the outback away from people, hidden away from civilization. If it's true that it's been discovered again, it would be a major miracle. Number 3. Mother's Remains all right, strap in for a disturbing story. This one takes us to the south of Australia, and the story begins way back in 1973. It was a cold case. Colleen Adams vanished 45 years ago and was assumed to be a murder victim. Well, in 2018, her skeletal remains were finally found when they were dug up by police. 
And where did they find her? That's right, under the driveway of a home that she had shared with her husband in the west of Adelaide. Apparently, it had been the woman's husband who had murdered her 45 years ago, then buried her in the ground and covered the grave with a concrete slab to disguise it as a driveway. He even took the police to the place and pointed at the exact location where the body would be discovered, and it very quickly was. According to the Daily Mail, Jeffrey Adams admitted to his heinous crime and has since been charged with the murder of his wife. He will undoubtedly go to jail for the rest of his life, which probably won't be that long considering he's already 70 years old. He already got away with the murder for 45 years. It doesn't seem quite fair if you ask me. Number 2. Secret Underground Room a woman from Pennsylvania recently discovered a piece of history underneath of her house. It wasn't exactly under the driveway, but it was a secret room below her basement. And it's such a fascinating story that it deserves to be told. You see, Alexandra Poulos from Lansdowne, Pennsylvania, discovered what was once a part of the Underground Railroad. She had always loved her colonial home, and had often dreamed about there being secret rooms inside the massive house. Then after her mother and brother passed away, her father signed over the rights of the home to her. That way the house would remain in the family. But then things in the basement started to break and needed some fixing. Eventually cracks showed up in the walls downstairs. And that was when the discovery was made. After she had the cracks in the wall fixed, Alexandra remembered a rumor that her house had once been part of the Underground Railroad. And since it now belonged to her, she asked the workers if they could dig deeper into the basement and see if they could find anything. The very next day, they actually did find something. They broke through the basement floor and found a room 14 feet beneath where the house should have ended. It was a whole different section of the house. According to local historians, there are plenty of reasons for hidden rooms to be in houses that are that old. And it could definitely have been part of the Underground Railroad. However, there isn't much that can be done to prove what happened, seeing as the house is so old and there wouldn't be many records available of people being hidden in secret basement rooms. Number 1. James Bond Driveway The last item today is the James Bond Driveway. This amazing mansion comes with a secret hidden driveway unlike anything you have ever seen before. So yeah, it's not really a discovery, but it's still a secret hidden under a driveway and it's possibly the coolest thing I've ever seen. The house is known as the Grand Turak Mansion, and it's worth somewhere around $12 million. The driveway I'm talking about is cantilevered and leads down beneath the ground into a massive eight-car garage that looks like something out of a James Bond movie or even maybe Batman's Batcave. The mansion itself is pretty impressive, and it definitely makes me a little jealous to look at. What about you? But the real gem is the hidden driveway and the beautiful cars stored in this secret underground car lair. This is the kind of discovery I want to be making underneath my driveway. So what do you think is buried under your driveway? What's the strangest item you've ever stumbled upon in your whole life? Sound off in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to World List for all the latest videos. We'll see you again soon.